Hello students, welcome to my channel. This video contains class 10 general knowledge Olympiad, previous year paper 2022. You can also find other Olympiad papers of class 10 in my channel. I have given the playlist link in the description box. Please do watch. Before going to the video, please do subscribe my channel for more videos. Let's move into the video now. The first section is general awareness. Question number one. It is one of the oldest living planet clones native to Tasmania. It is an unusual plant that bears flowers. It does not produce any fruits or seeds. It propagates by dropping a branch and letting the fallen branch take root and grow into a new plant identified. Options are King's Lomatia. Option B is a vegetable sheep. Option C is spotless water meal and option D is dragon arum. The right answer is, is option A, King's Lomatia. Question number 2. Which of the following represents a group of animals having four chambered heart? Option A, crocodile, lizard, turtle. Option B, lizard, bat, fish. Option C, frog, lizard, pigeon. Then option D is cow, crow, bat. The right answer is, it's option a D, cow, crow, bat. Question number 3. Octopus has blue blood due to the presence of the pigment to be filled up in its blood. Option A, hemocyanin, hemoglobin, chlorocruorine and hemerythrin. The right answer is, it's option A, hemocyanin. Question number 4. This breed of duck shown in the picture is most commonly kept as a companion duck. In China, it is referred to as a Songsi Quan, which means a puffy lion dog. Identify it. Options are Sheikh Tushu, Chow Chow, and Lhasa Apso. Option D is it's a Pekingese. The right answer is it's option B, Chow Chow. Question number 5. Which of the following is not in the list of World Heritage Sites of UNESCO in India? Option A. Nanda Devi and Valley of Flowers National Parks. Option B. Sundarbans National Park. Option C. The Western Guards. Option D. Is it's Dachingam National Park. The right answer is it's option D. Dachingam National Park. Question number 6. The Nilgiri Thar is A or an? Option extinct species, endangered species, near threatened species, a vulnerable species. The right answer is the Nilgiri Thar is endangered species. Question number 7. Caroline Mickelson was the first woman to reach Antarctica, cross English Channel, reach space, climb Mount Everest. The right answer is it's option A, reach Antarctica. Question number 8. Biodiesel is an alternative fuel similar to conventional or fossil diesel. Which of these can be used in producing biodiesel? Options are waste cooking oil, soya bean oil, animal fat, all of this. The right answer is it's option D, all of this. Question number 9. Select the incorrect statement. Options are the melting point and electrical conductivity of an alloy is less than that of a pure metal. Bronze is an alloy of copper and zinc. Solder is an alloy of tin and lead. If one of the metal is mercury, then the alloy is called amalgam. So the, uh, the question is, which is the incorrect one? Yes, it's bronze is an alloy of copper and zinc is the incorrect one. Question number 10. Which of the following materials is most suitable for making the core of an electromagnet. Options are soft iron, brass, steel, aluminium. The answer is it's option A, soft iron. Question number 11. Which of the following types of laser is used in laser printers? Options are semiconductor laser, dye laser, option C is, is gas laser and option D is none of this. The right answer is it's option A, semiconductor laser. Question number 2. 12. 
He received the Nobel Peace Prize 1964 at the age of 35 for his non-violent struggle for civil rights for the Afro-American population. Who is he? Options are a Malcolm X. Option B is Nelson Mandela. Option C is a Martin Luther King Jr. And then option D is it's Desmond Tutu. The right answer is it's option C. Martin Luther King. Question number 13. Which of the following is a national political party in India? Rashtriya Janata Dal, Bahunjan Samaj Party, Indian National Lok Dal, Lok Jana Shakti Party. The right answer is national political party in India is its Bahujan Samaj Party. Question number 14. The Right to Information Act was enacted in. To be filled up. Options are 2005, 1998, 2001, 2010. The right answer is its option A, 2005. Question number 15. Which of the following does not come under the primary sector? Options are agriculture, forestry, quarrying, banking. The right answer is its option D, banking. Question number 16. Which of the following countries is the largest producer of copper? Chile, Peru, Indonesia, China. The right answer is it's option A, Chile. Question number 17. Bundestag is the parliament of Germany, Iran, France, Qatar. The right answer is it's option A, Germany. Question number 18. He was an Indian philosopher. and social leader born on 12th february 1824 in gujarat his original name was amul shankar tiwari and he was the founder of arya samaj who was he options are swami vivekananda option b swami dayananda saraswati option c swami shratananda then option d is ramakrishna paramhamsa so the question is His original name was Mool Shankar Tiwari. Who is he? Yes, it's option B, Swami Dayanand Saraswati. Question number nineteen. Violin is a wooden string instrument. It is played by drawing a bow across its strings. How many strings does a standard violin usually have? Three, four, five, six. The right answer is it's option B, four strings. Question number twenty: Who has authored the famous book *The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People*? Options are Dan Brown. Option B is Stephen R. Covey. Option C is Rick Riordan, and option D is Apollo Coelho. Coelho. So the right answer is it's option B, Stephen R. Covey. Question number twenty-one: Which of the following words means? the ability to make good judgments and quick decisions option a a cost a cumen a bagel clamor the right answer is it's option b a cumen question number 22 which of the following awards is presented annually in the us to recognize achievement in the music industry option a atom awards option b Laurizen Awards, Option C, Grammy Awards, Option D is Emmy Awards. The right answer is it's Option C, Laurizen Awards. Question number twenty-three. What are the dimension of the boarded polo ground? Options are three hundred yards long and one sixty yards wide. Option B, one fifty yards long and ninety yards wide. Option C, five hundred yards. long and 200 yards wide option d 350 yards long and 160 yards wide the right answer is it's option a question number 24 which of the following cups or trophies is awarded to women in badminton options are uber cup option b is a wisden trophy option c is is a merdeka cup and option d is walker cup The right answer is it's option A, Uber Cup. Question number twenty-five: Who among the following is not a football player? Option A, Bai Chang Bhutia. Option B, Gurpreet Singh Sandhu. 
ऑप्शन सी हारमनप्रीत सिंह एंड ऑप्शन डी इज सुनील छेत्री द क्वेश्चन इज हु इज नॉट अ फुटबॉल प्लेयर येस इट्स ऑप्शन सी हारमनप्रीत सिंह क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स Who among the following has won the Dronacharya Award for Athletics in 2021? Option A, T. P. Oshap. Option C, Option B is Dharmendra Tiwari. Option C is Om Prakash Dahiya. Option D is Sarkar Talwar. The right answer is it's option A, T. P. Oshap. Question number twenty-seven. Which of the following asanas is a sitting asana? Option A, Trigonasana. Option C. पवन मुक्ताशन ऑप्शन सी अर्धा अमत्स एंद्राशन एंड ऑप्शन डी इज इज तड़ाशन सो द राइट आंसर इज इट्स ऑप्शन सी अर्ध मच्छेन्द्राशन क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी एट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम इज आर डेवलप्ड टू रन ऑन स्मार्ट फोन एंड टैबलेट्स ऑप्शन आर एंड्रॉइड आई ओ एस मैक ओ एस बोथ ए एंड बी The right answer is it's option A, D, both A and B. Question number twenty-nine. In a certain code language, the word "exclusive" is written as some coded word. How will "sensitive" be written in the same code language? We'll solve now. So first, we'll write down the alphabets first. Okay, write down the alphabets. A, B, C, D, E, F. G H I J K L M. Write a uh, half of you can write M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. You just write first thirteen thirteen alphabet and next thirteen alphabet. So you you will get um, easily. Then I am going to numbering the letters. So for this question. It requires you have to number the letters from the reverse order. Then only you will get the answer. See, listen. Uh, it is depend upon the question. So every time it will not like this. You can or uh, number the letters from the general order. That is from A to Z. You can number. But here I am going to number from Z to A. So ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Right. Now we'll write on the word exclusive here. Exclusive. Right. U, K, X, G, T, Z. G Z E N. Okay. So now what we have to do means first again you just number the given letter. So E is numbered as here twenty two, right? E is numbered as twenty two. X is numbered as three. X is numbered as three. Correct. Then C is numbered as twenty four. Then L is numbered as fifteen. U is numbered as six. Here eight. Here eighteen. Here five. Here twenty-two. Twenty-two. Again U is six. K is sixteen. Three. Twenty. Then T is um. It's seven. I write. Then G is twenty. Is it as one? E is twenty-two. Then N is thirteen. Okay. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to split the word exclusive. First four, then middle, then last four. You can see here, no. First four, middle, last four. Next is this E is coded as G here. E is coded as G. How E is numbered as twenty-two, G is numbered as twenty. So the difference is minus two. Again, X is coded as Z. X is coded as Z. So just look at the number three. Here it is one. 
so 3 minus 2 is 1 correct then in the same way c is coded as e c is coded as e see here 24 minus 2 is 22 then l l is 15 no so 15 minus 2 is 13 so n is coded as so l is coded as n in the same way you can take down the word u and t so here it is going like this from 7 uh, or you can take like this 6 plus 1 is 7 or 7 minus 6 so we will take down like this 6 plus 1 is 7 so we will write down the rule plus 1 so here minus 2 here minus 2 here also minus 2 here minus 2 here plus 1 in the same way here yes no this last four part no last four part you can look yes is coded as u how yes is numbered as 8 u is numbered as 6 so you will be getting minus 2 again the difference is coming like minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 so this is the rule you have to follow for the word given word sensitive so let's have a look on this sensitive will split down like this just number this is 8 this is 22 this is 13 this is 8 this is 18 7 18 5 22 correct so t is coded as 7 t is coded as t is coded as 7 minus 2 that is 5 then 18 is coded as 18 minus 2 is it is 16 then v is coded as 5 minus 2 is 3 then 22 minus 2 is 20 correct then 18 plus 1 is 19 here again s is coded as 8 minus 2 is 6 then 22 minus 2 is 20 here 11 here 6 so which word is coded as 5 yes the word so the letter is v k x z h u g e u so this is the required coded word for the uh, code word for the word sensitive so just the rule is nothing but minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 here plus 1 here minus 2, here minus 2, here minus 2, minus 2. Right. So, answer is it's option C is the right answer. Question number 30. Two years ago, father was three times as old as his son. And two years hence, twice his age will be equal to five times that of his son. Find the present age of father. So, now we'll solve this one. Two years ago. Father was three times as old as his son. Now let us take. Let's take son's age. Son's age B. X. So two years ago. Two years ago. Son's age become x minus 2. In the same way, 2 years ago, his father's age two years ago, his father's age was 3 times as old as him. Which means, 3 times means 3 times x minus 2. 3 times as old as his son, so it becomes 3 times x minus 2. Correct? So if we want, we'll solve it. 3x minus 6. This is the age of his father 2 years ago. Now, what is his present age of the father? Present age of father. It becomes like this. 3x minus 6 plus 2. It becomes 3x minus 4. This is present age. Now, 
टू इयर्स हेंस एज ऑफ फादर टू इयर्स राइट डाउन एज ऑफ फादर टू इयर्स हेंस विच मीन्स आफ्टर टू इयर्स सो प्रसेंट एज इज थ्री एक्स माइनस फोर सो आफ्टर टू इयर्स इज फादर्स एज बिकम्स लाइक दिस थ्री एक्स माइनस फोर प्लस टू इज ईक्वल टू थ्री एक्स माइनस टू दिस इज the two years hence father sage right then what is the age of uh, sons after two years age of son sage age of son two years hence so already this is let son sage be x means it must it must be the present age right so after 2 years his age becomes x plus 2 years now according to the question after 2 years twice his age will be equal to 5 times that of his sons twice his age means father's age right so according to the question what we are going to write twice his age so father's age after 2 years becomes twice his age Twice means two times three x minus two. It must be equal to five times that of his son. Five times means five times x plus two. Correct. This three x minus two is age of the father after two years. X plus two is age of the son after two years. So the condition is twice his age, twice father's age will be equal to five times that of his son. so this is the given condition now we'll solve this one 6x minus 4 equal to 5x plus 10 just transpose 6x minus 5x equal to 10 plus 4 become x is equal to 14 so who is x here here yes son's age so the present age of son is 14 years right then what is present age of father so this is the present age of the father now we have to substitute here 3 into 3 times 14 minus 4 correct that is 42 minus 4 equal to 38 So thirty-eight years. Option A is the right answer. Next section is current affairs. Question number thirty-one. Which Indian state ranked first in Asia in affordable talent in global startup ecosystem report twenty twenty-two? Options are Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Assam, Uttarakhand. The right answer is it's option B, Kerala. Question number thirty-two: Who has become the first Indian cyclist to win a silver in a continental tournament in the senior category of the Asian Track Championship? Option A: Esso Alban. Option B: Ronaldo Singh Lithonjam. Option C: Is Navin John. Option D: Is Arvind Panwar. So the question is: Who has become the first Indian cyclist to win a silver in a continental tournament? Right. So the right answer is it's option B Ronaldo Singh Lithonjam Question number 33 the first train under the Bharat Gaurav scheme of Indian Railways was flagged off between Coimbatore in Tamil Nadu and Shirdi in Maharashtra option B is Navi Mumbai in Maharashtra and Ahmedabad in Gujarat option C is puri in odisha and hyderabad in telangana option d is jaipur in rajasthan and ahmedabad in gujarat the right answer is it's option a question number 34 who was awarded with the 2020 sorry 2022 world food prize option a saintia rosenswick option b sakuntala hara singh tetstrip and option c is ratanlal option d is david naboro 
The right answer is it's option A. Cynthia Rosenberg. Question number 35. Ruby Fallup is the current president of the Republic of Maldives. Option A is Cyril Ramfosa. Option B is Ibrahim Mohamed Soli. Option C is Yoveri Musweni. Option D is none of this. The right answer is it's option B. Ibrahim Mohamed Soli. Question number 36. Who was awarded the 2022 Templeton Prize? Option A, Frank Wilsick. Option B, Jan Goodall. And option C is Marcelo Glazier. Then option D is Francis Collin. The right answer is, it's option A, Frank Wilsick. Question number 37. Which of the following has become India's 52nd Tiger Reserve? Ramgar Vishadri Tiger Reserve. Option B is Manas Tiger Reserve. Option C is Sundarban Tiger Reserve. Option D is Dudwa Tiger Reserve. The right answer is it's option A. Ramgar Vishdari Tiger Reserve. Question number 38. Neera Chopra set a new national record with to be filled up. Javelin throw at a power Nurmi Games 2022 in Finland. Option A, 89.30 meter. Option B, 88.07 meter. Option C is 88.58 meter. And option D is 87.58 meter. The right answer is it's option A, 89.30. Question number 39. What was the theme of World Day of Social Justice 2022? Achieving social justice through formal employment, closing the Sorry, closing the inequalities gap to achieve social justice, a call for social justice in the digital economy, workers on the move, the quest for social justice. The right answer is, it's option A. When is Sashman Bharat Divas celebrated in India? 30th April, 20th May, 16th June, 18th August. It's option A is the right answer. The next section is life skill. Question number 41. Which of the following does not show sportsmanship? Playing within the rules, accepting defeat without whining or making excuses, intentionally committing fouls, a fair, generous and polite behavior towards opponents. The right answer is it's option C. Intentionally committing fouls. Question number 42. Teamwork refers to Taking control of a group to get your work done. Creating problems for others to succeed in your ventures. Working with a team in order to achieve a common goal. Seeking external support to complete your work. The answer is, it's option C. Working, in, working with a team in order to achieve a common goal. Question number 43. Day-to-day stress. Day-to-day stress can be managed by being assertive. Which of the following will not help you to stay assertive? Option A, expressing your opinion and speaking directly. Option B, avoiding eye contact during a conversation. Option C, valuing yourself and your rights. Then option D is it's taking accountability of your own mistakes. The right answer is it's option B. Question number 44, a nation that destroys its soil, destroys itself. Who said this? Option A, Franklin Roosevelt. Option B, Mahatma Gandhi. Option C, Rabindranath Tagore. Option D, Stewart Udall. The right answer is, it's option A, Franklin T. Roosevelt. Question number 45, which characteristic represents a procrastinator? Options are, desire to help others, not able to say no, postponing unpleasant task, all of this. The right answer is, it's option C, postponing unpleasant task. The last section is Achiever section. Question number 46, read the given statement carefully and state T for true and F for false. Now we'll solve the first one. The mean of first 17 whole number is 10. We have to find whether the mean of 17 whole number is 10 or not. So what is the, uh, what is the first 17 whole numbers? It starts with 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 
right so 0 to 16 is the seventh first 17 whole number so we all know we have the formula that is mean is equal to sum of observation it's divided by total number of observation right total number of observation so sum of observation means you have to add all the observation up to 16 total number of observation is here 17 so you have to add all the first 17 uh, 17 whole numbers no so what would you get yes you will be getting 136 divided by 17 so when you divide you will be getting 8 so the mean of first uh, 17 whole number is 8 it's not 10 so statement 1 is false here statement 2 if the mean a median and mode of the observation 7 comma 7 comma 5 comma 7 and x are same then the value of x is 9 so it's very simple question it's been said that mean median and mode are same no which means what let us take mode is 7 we all know how to find them for how to find mode right yes most occurrence observation here the most occurrence observation is is nothing but 7 so here mode is 7 it said that mean median mode are of these given observation all are same so obviously mean also 7 mean also equal to 7 so we have the formula what is mean yes sum of all observation divided by number of observation right sum of just now we have seen no, the previous sum sum of observation divided by total number of observation okay so what is mean here it mean is 7 so sum of observation means 7 plus 7 plus 5 plus 7 plus x total number of observation here is it's totally 5 data are there so now we do the simplification process that is totally when you add 21 21 plus 5 is 26 plus x divided by 5 so again 35 equal to 26 plus x therefore x is equal to 9 so the value of x is 9 is true. So statement 2 is true here. It's correct. The third statement is the mean of i number is 10. If each number is decreased by 3, then the mean of new number is 13. So mean of phi number is mean of 5 number is it's 10 then what is sum of all the five numbers then what is sum of five numbers it's simple it's 10 into 5 is equal to 50 right so this is sum of all the five numbers the question is if each number is decreased by 3 if each number is decreased by 3 then here we have five numbers so it must be 15 right so decrease of 5 number 1 each number is decreased by 3 then then what is decrease of 5 number it's 3 into 5 that is 15 so we have to subtract this 15 from the sum of 5 number sum of 5 number what is sum of 5 number we already have 50 no so 50 minus 15 that is 35 is equal to sum of old 5 number minus decrease of 5 number that is 50 minus 15 is equal to 35 so this is sum of new 5 number then the mean of new number is 13 it's very simple what is mean we know the formula sum of Sum of new 5 number divided by total number of observation. Total number of observation. 
so sum of new 5 number is here 35 total number is already 5 only no so 35 divided by 5 which is equal to 7 so the new mean of the 5 number is 7 but here it is given as 13 so again the third statement is false so this one is false this one is true and this one is false right so the right answer for this uh, question is its option a is the right answer question number 47 identify the famous architect architects w x y and z from the given information w is a famous building designed by him or the walt disney concert hall in los angeles and louis vuitton foundation in paris x the person x is one of the pioneer of a modern architecture some of the famous building designed by him or the Roby house in Chicago and the falling water house in Pennsylvania the person why is he won Pritzker prize in 1998 and famous building designed by him or the shard in London and the Whitney Museum of American Art in New York City the last person is it is some of the buildings designed by him are not Dame Du Hart and the Villa Savoy in France. Yes, it's option C. W. S. Frank Gehry. Option uh, X is the person X is Frank Lloyd Wright and the person Y is Renzo Piano. Then uh, the person is it is Lee Corbusier. So finally, option C is the right answer. Question number forty-eight. Select the correct statement. There are five types of writs in the Indian constitution. The concept of procedure established by the law in Indian constitution has been taken from the Japanese constitution. Statement 3 is, at the time of adoption, the Indian constitution contained 395 articles in 22 parts and 8 schedules. The last statement is, the 8th schedule of Indian constitution deals with the official languages in India. So the question is select the correct statement right so finally all the given statements are correct here so option d is the right answer question number 49 match the column and select the correct option in column one the name of the mascot is given in column two games is given the name of the games is given option p is a somaiti option q is a bing duen duen then option r is a mirai tova then option s is a shui ron ron right so, Somaiti, the mascot of uh, Somaiti, the, the, sorry, the name of the uh, mascot is it Somaiti, uh, which is used in, I think it's in summer, Paralympics. And Bing Duen Duen is a mascot of Winter Olympics 2022. Then option R is a Merai Tova. It's a mascot, mascot of a Summer Olympics 2020. Then Shoi Ron, Ron is mascot of a winter paralympics 2022 right so it's option a is the right answer question number 50 which of the following can be possible reason in your computer is working very slow options are running out of disk space option b is malware or virus attacks option c is running out of ram random access memory then option d is all of this right answer is it's option d all of this Hope you all like this video. Thanks for watching.